Okay, one of the questions I've received is how can you destroy a demon? Or how can you kill a demon? I just want to share two experiences that I've had. So when you bind a demon, it does not actually kill the demon. However, it will trap the demon. To destroy the demon, you need to cast it into the sun. Here is how I came about this method. So one day, out of the blue, two demons pitched up and hung around me. One was purple and one was mustard in color. And both were of non-human shape. I was not sure why they were hanging around me and they kept trying to look inside me. They would press against me. It felt like a balloon pressing against you and try and look inside me. They did not interact with me or harm me in any way. After a few days, I got fed up and did the following. I imagined a cardboard box and said, In the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I command you to go into this box. I watched as the demons went into the box and then I closed the box. I visualized I had a rope in my hand and I started to tie the box similar to how you would tie a gift box in the name of God and tied one direction, the Son and tied the other direction and the Holy Spirit tying the first direction again and I made a knot. I bind you and cast you into the sun. What happens is the demon will go into the sun and transmute into a new energy and cease to be a demon and they will not return to earth. I can't see past the sun so I can't confirm what they changed to or where they go. The odd thing was that afterwards I realized I had done exactly what they wanted. They wanted to move on. They were tired of being evil. The second method is definitely destroyed or killed the demon. I stumbled on this method by accident. I was hanging clothes outside on a trolley. I had thrown lots of cool salt on the floor of my apartment to keep the demons out. I did not see the demons sitting on the trolley and pushed the trolley in, into my house. The trolley was surrounded by cool salt. After a while, I could sense something or someone in great distress and turned my head towards the closed trolley. Sitting on the trolley was a demon. I could only see the outline and sense his energy. It was like a see-through demon. The demon then jumped up onto the ceiling and was hanging on for dear life. Eventually, it could not hang any longer and fell to the ground. It was bubbling and melting away. And I just stood there and watched until nothing was left. The demon did not make a sound. It reminded me of a snail on a bed of salt. Until this moment, I never knew it was possible to actually kill a demon. This demon did not transmute into another energy. It ceased to exist. It was dead. I hope you found this informative. And please comment below should you like to add to the experience or have any questions.